Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, I will show you how to use the multiplane scrape brush. Scrapes the mesh with two angled planes at the same time, producing a sharp edge between them. This is useful for creating edges when sculpting hard surface objects. So let's go over here, hold and drag your mouse cursor or your graphic or your drawing tablet pen, hold and drag to see the effect of this brush of this brush as shown here. By going over here to brush settings, we have different features and operators factors like a plain angle also it's over here it's a good feature for this uh, for this brush the angle it's the angle between the two planes of the brush for example let's uh, decrease it to 34 degrees and you can see that you have this angle between these two two created planes using this brush is 34 degrees also for here for here is 16 16 degrees it's great to distinguish between these two processes so let's make it for example 72 degrees go over here to try to try to draw using this brush so as defined it's the angle between the two planes of the brush pressing control inverts the angle so go over here to press the control rotate this uh, sphere you can't see the effect exactly when holding and uh, when when holding control and drawing using this brush will invert the angle Let's go back to brush settings. We see dynamic mode. It's over here. What is dynamic mode? When this uh, feature enabled, the base angle is sampled from the mesh surface. The plane angle controls how much the angle will increase when applying pen pressure. When pressing control, it, lo it locks the plane angle to zero degrees. So let's disable it and we try to see the difference. Yes, we have see the difference that we have no pressure to be applied over the mesh surface. So let's go to see the other feature to distinguish this brush from the others. We have it has many different good features for do, for doing that so let's enable dynamic mode again when disabling show cursor preview the show cursor preview what can this do for a mesh this displays a preview of the two square planes and the angle they form instead of the cursor while performing the stroke so when disabling it again let's see the difference we have the previous processes you can see the effect clearly and displays preview of the two scribe planes the angle the form instead of the cursor when performing the stroke